So here's how I'm thinking about this question. I'm pretending that I'm the manager of bookstore X and my nemesis is the manager of bookstore Y. And we have a long time rivalry going on to see whose bookstore can sell more books. And so we're looking at the numbers for last week. Of course, I'm hoping to win. So I'm hoping that the answer to this question is yes, my store sold more books than his store. And what I'm thinking when I look at statement one is Yes, I won on Saturday, right? My store sold more books. It was more than a thousand versus fewer than a thousand. So my store was the winner on Saturday. But I wanted to know who is the winner for the entire week. And Saturday is just one day. So statement one is not sufficient on its own. And we should go ahead and eliminate the answer choices that claim that it is. So A and D are gone and we're down to B, C or E. Now, statement two on its own is essentially telling us how big of a deal Saturday was in relation to the rest of the week. Like what I mean by that is, was Saturday an important day? Was it an, an important driver for the amount of sales that we had that week? Or wasn't it? And what I'm learning from statement two is that in the case of my store, store X, Saturday wasn't all that important as a driver of sales last week, but in the other store, the one we're competing against, there Saturday was an important driver of sales. It accounted for more than one-fifth of the sales last week. Now, on its own, I don't see how this can answer the question because how important Saturday was for each of the stores last week, that in and of itself couldn't possibly tell us which store sold more books. So I'm going to go ahead and eliminate answer choice B and we'll combine the statements right after the intro. All right, so let's take stock of everything we know when we combine these statements. On the one hand, I know that I was the winner on Saturday. On the other hand, I know that Saturday wasn't even that big of a deal for my store last week. So what does that tell me? If, if we sold more books on a weaker day and they sold fewer books on a stronger day, then we must have won the competition. Saturday wasn't even that big of a deal for us and for them it was. And on that day, we won well, then our whole week must have been stronger. So I'm going to go ahead and say that, yes, together these statements are sufficient, and the correct answer is C. If you found this video useful, go to quantreasoning.com for a lot more where that came from. You should also click that like button and let me know in the comments below what you'd like me to make future videos about. And of course, if you haven't yet subscribed, go ahead and do that and click that bell below so you get notified about future videos. See you next time.